I think that it's frankly racist, and we can, we've can we all seen that today. I don't really think that there's anything else I have to say about that. It speaks for itself. Three Democratic reps face possible expulsion from the Tennessee House for their role in a demonstration calling for gun control. The Republican-dominated House expelled two, Justin Jones and Justin Pearson. Gloria Johnson was not expelled. It's a decision many are calling, quote, racially motivated. But still, what's the difference where I made it through mm -hmm. and these two young men did not make it through? I think you're right. We know. We know what? I will answer your question. It might have to do with the color of our skin. The decision came after all three chanted with gun control supporters. That protest came in the wake of last month's deadly shooting at the Convenant School in Nashville. We're standing with our constituents who are demanding that we take action on the crisis of mass shootings. Yeah. We said we want a ban on assault weapons. They said we're going to assault democracy. Yeah. Rather than pass laws that will address red flags and banning assault weapons and universal background checks, they passed resolutions to expel their colleagues. Yeah. Yeah. And they think that the issue's over. After the vote was made, all three held a press conference where they criticized the decision. I don't know about what's going to happen with the reappointment, but I do hope to get reappointed to serve in the state legislature by the Shelby County Commissioners. And a lot of them I know are upset about the anti-democratic behavior of this white supremacist-led state legislature. Tennessee Black Caucus members also spoke out. But the optics, the world saw the optics. I don't have to say a word about the fact that our two young African-American brothers were unfairly prosecuted. Yesterday, it looked like a Jim Crow era trial where we saw two black men fighting for their careers, fighting for their reputations, fighting for their political lives. Banishment is rare and has only been done a few times since the Civil War. According to the Associated Press, Tennessee GOP leaders said the expulsion was necessary to, quote, avoid setting a precedent that lawmakers' disruptions of House proceedings through protest would be tolerated. Both Justin Pearson and Justin Jones have vowed to return to the Capitol next week to continue advocating. They thought they won today, but Come they don't on. realize. Yeah, yeah, they don't yeah, realize what they started. Yeah. They started a movement they can't stop. They started, they thought it, that we were creating good trouble there, but we're on the outside now. Yeah. And so I hope to see you all here on Monday. Yeah. Monday for the House session, because every week until this session adjourns, we will return, whether we're inside the chamber or outside That's the chamber. Right. Yeah. This is Inside Edition Digital.